Hello everybody, I'm Usama Kharfan, I'm a PhD student at the University of Tizi Wuzu. In this work, in this work I will introduce the graphene synthesized method and their title synthesized of graphene two-dimensional 2D material by liquid fast exfoliation of graphite. Abstract Graphene is two-dimensional 2D material it has brought a lot of attention around the world because of its extraordinary ex, uh, extra, extraordinary properties. Graphene consists of a single layer of carbon atoms in the form of a honeycomb, honeycomb structure. It has been first synthesized in 2004 by Ender Game. Several methods are used for the manufacture of graphene among this method and the most effective for the protection of graphene is the liquid was exfoliation of graphite which occurs in the presence of a dispersing, dispersing medium and an external energy to allow the liquid medium to penetrate between the layers of graphene and breaks the van der Waals bonds. Graphene preparation technique. There are several graphene preparation techniques that can be classified in two categories. Top category, top down and bottom up. In the first one, uh, one mainly using graphite as a raw material and using exfoliation to reduce the van der Waals interaction between the graphene layers like mechanical exfoliation, direct liquid was exfoliation and electrochemical exfoliation. Here is a representative di diagram of liquid was exfoliation of graphite. Graphite powder is mixed with a solvent has suitable physical qualities such as viscosity, surface tensions. Etc. is then subjected the mix the, to mixing by an external energy for separating the sheets of graphene. In Figure One, UV visible absorption spectra of graphene nanosheet suspensions prepared from liquid exfoliation of graphite. It was observed that the absorption peak was at 273 and 73 nanometers. This achievement is in good agreement with the reported result for the absorption spectra or graphene nanosheets. Also, the absence of an absorption peak in 229 nanometers, which is related to graphene oxide. And ensures the absence of of graphene oxide in the in the sample. Conclusion: Graphene is very interesting to the emotional matter in all fields and widely used since its its discovery. Graphene has opened it up an important field of research in nanocomposites and also in high frequency electronic application, electrode, chemical sensor storage and conversion conversions of solar solar energy and high frequency frequen, frequency transistor. And for these methods and research have been made for the, the purpose of improving the conditions of production and obtaining high quality graphene and with less cost. Thank you for your attention.